Hello people, in this video we want to look at breath holding spells. So basically this is a pediatrics topic. This comes under behavioral disorder. So uh, under behavioral disorder we have so many behavioral disorders like eating disorders, so many other. In this video we will look at breath holding spells. Okay. Now this one is, um, you should watch videos uh, which show how the child behaves. It just cries and then what happens when it is crying? It will uh, stop at full expiration and then it kind of stop, you know, choke. You will be waiting for it to expire and, you know, let the breath out kind of a thing. Hope you, I think you would have seen this in babies when they are crying. So the child can become apneic, cyanotic and pale. Okay. So basically this is a, how do you define a breath holding spell? It is a reflexive event. Okay. It is initiated by some provocative event that causes anger frustration or pain causing the child to cry so the first thing is there's an uh, ang anger frustration pain so as a reflex it will cry now when it cries it will cry 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 and it will stop at full expiration it will stop and then the child will become apneic cyanotic or pale okay then uh, in severe cases there can be some unconsciousness etc and hypotonic etc and uh, what happens, some tonic clonic movement also may occur if the spell lasts for a few, uh, more than a few seconds. Then anyways, it will uh, relax, it will become fine. So basically this uh, you will see uh, at the peak age of two years. Okay, this is what we have to remember. Peak age of two years, you will see this. So um, did you understand this breath holding spell guys? Look at some videos, you will understand. Then uh, how will you, uh, what should you do for this? Actually, this is uh, just parent reassurance. Tell the parent that everything is fine. Okay. So you will uh, do parental reassurance for the parent and uh, you should tell the parent don't pick up the child because that will reduce the blood flow to the brain. Okay, because now uh, that it's sleeping, it is kind of at least getting some uh, blood flow to the brain. So don't pick up the child. That's what you have to remember. Turn him sideways so that any secretions are there, it can drain. So turn the child sideways. Remember, standard uh, treatment for any seizure, etc. Lateral position so they don't aspirate, right? And uh, remain calm. Who will remain calm? The parent, parent has to remain calm and you should do not show undue concern to this child. Okay. Don't give in to the child's demands, especially if it is because of anger or frustration. Okay. This is the management. Wow. And um, that's it, right? That's it. So basically as a doctor, what you should do, no, you should, uh, before you reassure the patient, you should make sure that this is not a seizure or a cardiac arrhythmia. Okay. So you should check if it is because of seizure, you should distinguish any provoking event, stereotype pattern of events, you should dis distinguish breath holding spells from seizures and cardiac arrhythmia also you should check if there is a long QT syndrome you should rule out, arrhythmias you should rule out, okay all this you should have to rule out, okay. So then then only you will assure the patient that your the parent that everything is fine, take the baby, put it in left and lateral position if they do this so that they don't aspirate, don't pick up the child because that will decrease the blood flow to the brain. One more thing is the child should know nobody is going to come and pick me up. Right. One more thing. That is another advantage. And then what you should do? You should not give in to the child's demands. Nowadays children are having too much attention because they are single child or some things like that. Right. Okay. Nowadays children, they will have four grand ch uh, grandparents, two parents and one child plus one caretaker also they will have. Right. So these many people will be there for the child. Seven is that seven children, seven people to take care of one baby kind of a thing. Anyways, um, that's nice. Uh, so breath holding spells you have to manage. Okay, bye bye. Let's see what this baby is trying to say. It's become cyanotic. Okay. Okay, fine. Bye bye. 